Hello, I'm Christina and welcome to my channel. This is a 15 minute gentle yoga flow. Slowly come down onto your hands and your knees, touch your toes together, separate your knees, hips distance apart. Bring your forehead to the ground, relax your torso over your thighs and reach your arms out in front of you. Breathe deeply here in child's pose. Slowly come up onto your hands and your knees, shins parallel, hands under your shoulders, spine is neutral. Inhale, look up and forward, tuck your toes for cow pose. Exhale, untuck your toes, curve your spine in the opposite direction and look back towards your hips. Moving through cat and cow, on your inhales come for cow pose, on your exhales come to cat pose. Slowly come to stillness and tuck your toes, bring your forehead to the ground, keeping your hips up, coming, staying onto your knees, and reach your hands out for a puppy stretch or melting heart pose. and slowly come up. Gently make your way into a downward facing dog. Hold here, pressing your heels down towards the ground. You can bend your knees if that's a bit more comfortable for you and relax for a moment. Inhale, raise your heels, look forward and step your feet up to your hands. Reach your arms up, coming up to standing. Bring your hands down by your sides, mountain pose. Inhale, reach your arms up, looking up. Exhale, come to a forward fold. Plant your palms next to your feet on the ground. Step back into plank and lower yourself down onto the ground. Bring your forehead down and place your hands, framing your rib cage, elbows pointed up. Inhale, lift your head, your shoulders, and your chest off the ground for a low cobra. Exhale, bring your head back down. Repeat low cobra about three to four times. Once you are done, place your head down on the ground, tuck your toes, and press up into a downward facing dog. Inhale, raise your heels, bend your knees, look forward, step up to meet your hands, coming into a half forward fold with your hands on your shins, looking up, exhale, forward fold. Inhale, come up to standing, reach your arms up, and exhale, bring your hands down by your sides. Slowly make your way to a seated position on the ground. Bring your feet to meet each other at the center line of your body. Knees out to the side. Exhale, forward fold. You can hold onto your feet if you'd like. Relax here. Slowly make your way up, stretch your legs out, heels are on the ground, toes are pointed up and your feet are flexed. Knees are pointed up as well. Inhale, lengthen your spine, exhale, fold forward, reaching forward. Slowly make your way up. Cross your left leg over your right, bending both legs, bringing your right heel in towards your left foot. Twist around to the left by wrapping your right arm around your left leg and your left arm behind you. Slowly 
slowly unwind from the twist. Bring the left leg all the way behind you, keeping both knees bent. Place your right hand on the ground and reach your left arm up and over. You can come down onto your elbow or stay up on your hand, whichever is most comfortable for you. Stretch your left arm out on the diagonal, looking up, keeping both sits bones on the ground as much as you can, stretching the left side of your body. Inhale, come back up and reach over in the opposite direction, reaching your right arm up and over on the diagonal, looking up once again and hold. Slowly make your way up and come to a forward fold, folding over your right leg, reaching forward. Slowly come up, come back to a seated position on both sits bones and bend both of your legs once again, crossing your right leg over your left. Bring your left heel in towards your right glute. Wrap your left arm around your right leg. Your right arm is behind you and twist to the right. Take the right leg, bring it behind you with both knees bent. Bring your left hand down, your right arm up and over, keeping both hips as even as you can, looking upward. So we come back up and switch sides reaching over to the right with your left arm up on the diagonal. And come back up to center and forward fold. Slowly make your way back upright and swing your legs around, coming to lying on your back. Plug both knees in towards your chest, flexing both of your feet. Bring both of your legs over to the left, stretch your right leg out and flex your right foot. Twist over to the right and reach your right arm out onto the ground, looking over at that right hand. Relax here. Bring the right leg back up to center, holding on to either the calf or the hamstring or the foot if you can, if you would like to. You can use a strap if you would like to as well, and hold here. Bend both legs, twist your legs over to the right this time, stretching out the left leg. Looking over to the left with your left arm reaching out and breathe in this twist. Come back to center, stretch your left leg up, holding on to the calf or the hamstring or the foot or using a strap. Hold and breathe. 
let go of your left leg, cross your right ankle over your left thigh, bending both legs, flexing both feet, and hold. Switch sides, let go of your leg, crossing the left ankle over the right thigh, flex both feet, hold here. Release and come into a Shavasana, stretching your limbs out onto the ground, relaxing everything completely. Palms facing the ceiling, close your eyes, deepen your breathing through your nose, and focusing all of your attention on your breath. Bring some slow and gentle motion back into your body, resting on the right side of your body with your arm under your head for support when you're ready. Make your way up to a seated position, cross your shins, bring your hands to your legs, close your eyes and breathe deeply. Slowly open your eyes. You can bring your hands to meet at the center of your chest if you would like to, and bow your head to your fingertips. Thank you so much for practicing with me today. Thank you so much for practicing with me. I hope you enjoyed this sequence. Once again, if you would like this sequence ad-free, 
or a longer version of this sequence, 30 minutes long, check out the link in the description box below for my membership site. You can get it for seven days for free. All the classes on there are completely ad-free. Thank you so much for joining me, and I'll see you next time.